good afternoon, good evening, that's the name of welcome to the channel talk about anything. So today I'm gonna do a video. This video is about Mason in Ghana. You lay bricks. I've said it all my videos, but I don't understand why they do it like that because it's a waste of money, waste of resource, and a waste of time. And you can see the prices in Ghana right now, the cement, how much it is, and it's very expensive and you can if you can imagine that you use cement for the buildings to lay the bricks and then they use cement also to plaster the rooms it's a lot of money if there is another way to do it but the reason why I'm doing this video is that I saw this guy he's from Congo and uh, like three weeks ago I was walking the street and I, I saw him uh, I finished work and I saw this guy and he asked me if I can find a job for him and I asked him what kind of job are you looking for and he told me that he's uh, a builder I said oh nice 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 and and he was looking for a building job and how do you know that I'm a builder too because I was wearing the clothes so he told me that if I can find him a job, I said, no, I don't know, but uh, what kind of job are you looking for? And he said, Mason, like uh, lame bricks. And I told him that it's kind of difficult for him to find a job, you know, because the way um, the lame bricks in Africa is not the same thing how the lame bricks in Europe. And so to lay the bricks, he has to go to school and he said no 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 he has like experience like 10 years experience and he showed me what he can do and i told him that like i said what you learn in africa how to build your houses is not the same how to build houses like this if you do this they will kick you out so i'm going to show you guys what i mean about this and i'm going to show you guys that even though the way we lay bricks is not the right way I have a videos for you guys to show you guys that you can even do it better way to save your resource money and time faster way to do it and so that even if you are in Ghana and you want to do it like that you can also do it like this if you think that you can do some hobby if you want to lay some bricks because you want to do it but you're not amazing but you want to do it for hobby you can also use this method to lay some bricks for yourself it's easy to do it and i think people will like it and i hope that people understand what i'm trying to say this is not a hate video this is just education for you guys to understand what is going on in this world and before we start, I want to thank everybody that's going to watch this video, like it, comment, share it with your friends and family, and I hope that you guys subscribe to this channel. So let's watch the video. Oh yes, before we start here, you know, sometimes when Ghanaians we are building houses, we put some uh, white powder, not white powder, it's like milk, we put in the concrete. That one is called key coat, okay? And the Ghanaians will say it's a secret recipe or something. It's not a secret recipe. It's just to um, normally they paint it on the wall. But when you are going to do like going to pasta the wall, they paint it on the wall. But in Ghana they put it in the cement, or maybe in abroad they already put it in the uh, cement. I don't know. We use like uh, pop to plaster wall and okay so uh i hope that you guys understand what i'm trying to say so before we start the video i'm gonna say this a dutch contractor will tell this man that even his daughter who is five years old doesn't know anything about building construction how to lay bricks can even do this job better than this man and this is the reason why in Ghana, in Africa, the workers get less paid. They don't know how to do their job. Everybody knows it. 
every common person in Ghana can lay bricks, okay? But they don't want to do it. That is why they are hiring you to do it. But if they know that you can lay good bricks, they'll pay you more. In their mind, they think, oh, this is what I can do myself. But I don't want to do it because it's hard work. You know, so I will pay this guy to do it because he's not professional. Most of them don't even have tools. So they don't know that these people are not professional. They are just cheap labor. So this is the reason why they pay you less. If you have your equipment, you have the tools, you know how to do your job, they will pay you more. But right now, they're not going to pay you more because they know that you are just some amateurs. So let's watch the amateurs at work. Now you're going to see something disturbing. It doesn't make sense what he's doing, but he's doing it. And I don't know who taught us this nonsense, but look at what he's doing. Even you, that you don't know nothing about the uh, building construction, can do the same thing what he's doing. Even your daughter can do this work. So this is what I call wasting a lot of cement. One meter, I use one bag of cement. <laughs> okay, so let's continue. Oh, One inch. Oh. But this is not one inch, people. One inch is two and a half centimeter. Like, mm, like this. Two and a half centimeter. But look at this. This is like, let me check. Maybe seven. Seven centimeter. So, so that's a lot of chunk. So this is what they're using it. If, uh, like nine centimeter. This is what they're using, people. So instead of two and a half, they're using like seven. So that is like five centimeter cement they're using. That's almost like a brick they're using. So why don't they just use the brick then? But sometimes the level depends. You can see that what I mean. Look at here is the brick, and here is the other brick. So that is like nine nine centimeter. So they use like nine centimeter of cement, and if they use nine centimeter here, and they use another nine centimeter and the bricks is i think it's 20 uh, 20 centimeter that means they are used to <laughs> and i'm going to show you guys something okay so let's continue 
when you are at the end level, then the portion of it is lower. Uh -huh. And you have to raise it to flat to the higher levels. Okay, what what do you think he means about if it's lower, they have to raise it to the level? Now, I'm going to explain to you guys. He means... You see this, uh, this is the floor, right? You can see the floor is, I think, I think it's 15 centimeters, I think, 15 centimeters. I think this one is 15 centimeters. Now, if you look at this place, you can see this one is, is, is below. So this one is lower, this is higher. And he's saying that they want to raise it to become the same as this one so if this is 15 centimeter 15 centimeter you can see this 15 centimeter you can see 15 centimeter this side is 15 centimeter below now if you count one two three you see that one two three but you also have to understand that a brick is 20 centimeter. Okay? 20 centimeter. And you can, if you count from here, this is one, two, three, right? This is the same level as this one. If you count from here, this one is lower, it's uh, like 15, 15 centimeter uh, below the other one. If you count the bricks, one, two, three. But they are on the same, you see, line. That means that they have using, let's say, 20 centimeter of cement. 20 centimeter or 15 centimeter of cement, like this one. They have wasted 20 centimeter of cement to raise it to be to become the same level as this you can see the same level so just imagine how many cement they have used to be on the same level and the beauty of it is that they are going to plaster it so instead of because this one is lower they should just um, yeah use the line from here to here Mason it, mason it, mason it, mason it. It doesn't matter because they are going to what? Plaster it. So why the hell do you have to have it all on the same line? And this is the reason why they are using a lot of resources. Mental will blow you away. It doesn't make sense wasting money. So we're going to check how the Netherlands lady works. So this one is smaller bricks and we're going to check. This one is from uh, these people. So let's check. I've seen YouTube videos that people use the small bricks too but you can use the same system to do this big blocks too mainly I think it's because of the the cement is also too thick it should be like a little bit soft plus look at how they are laying the bricks so yeah that is what I'm going to say we're gonna do a video from Nicole Michael DIY. DIY means do it yourself. So she wanted to swim pool in the garden so that she can swim, but she can't afford it. So she's gonna do it herself. And you're going to see that she is even better than a Ghanaian who claimed to have like 10 years experience. This is why I said what I said. Let's continue. Opa, Opa. Nu even een kamer weg. Hier, hè? Ik ga nu 
Yeah. So this is the uh, reinforcement. This is like um, iron rocks. I made a video that I said that you can also put it in so that make it strong. <laughs> Look at how many, how much cement she's using. So little. But in Ghana, the water is, is one inches. Before you know this, seven inches. Look at how they're putting the cement between the stones. In Ghana, they will put it aside and then do like this. Simple. Look, look nice. So that is what I'm saying. Simple. So we're going to check another one, and this one is for the. This is a like I don't know, colored or. Yeah, it's like stones, but this one is soft. They this one they use it inside the, uh, the wall and then you have outside wall you have like no bricks or something else but this one let's check so you can see this one is very soft because this one is like light bricks Simple as that, you know. And move it away. Put something there. Nice. You can see that too. That one is also impossible, uh, like you can use. So this one is also like a way to, um, yeah, save cement from building construction. They're going to make it themselves. Um, aqui na ponta. Verifico se não corri, se minha medida tá certinha, um centímetro. Tá certinha, um centímetro. E tá certinho os ajustes, eu vou e coloco mais dois pregos em cada lugar aqui, ó. Mais um aqui. Esse prego vai impedir rotação agora, ele não rotaciona mais a peça. Aqui, tá vendo? Essa massa aqui, ó. Aí na hora que eu vou regular o venari, ó, e eu ajusto ela e corre ela pra frente, tá vendo?
Hum? Ó, aí aqui, ó, eu posso correr tanto para um lado ou tanto para o outro, ó. Tá vendo? Ela vai deixar a massa na altura. Feito isso aqui, né? Certinho, com a massa mais ou menos de 1 a 1,5 cm no máximo. Ó, só para efeito de demonstração mesmo, ó. Na hora que eu encosto aqui, ó, venaria, tem um buraquinho aqui, tá vendo? Essa massa aqui, ó. Aí na hora que eu vou regular o venaria, ó. So, I have another one for you guys, and this one is, he has like two methods, how to use it, he has like a, this one, just wooden, a wooden thing in his hand, left hand, and then he have this one, we already know what it is, so he's going to use uh, both of them to show us which one is better, okay, so let's go. Who was this here? Qual a melhor opção para vocês? Gabarito versus paleta. Lembrando, pessoal, que eu gostei dos dois, viu? Mas aí agora fica a critério de vocês. O que vocês acham? O que vocês acham melhor aí? So he's doing like the other ones. Let's check. Let's go a little bit. So when it's done, I think he is done. Principalmente se o tempo estiver muito quente. Por exemplo, aqui hoje para mim, está meio quente. Aí eu só levei até a metade ali para não arriscar a massa secar demais. And then in places like this. And what is just that, eh? In Ghana we don't do that. That's just why we do do the, the ch -ch 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 -ch, we do the like this. That makes sense. But this one is is better. You can see it's correct with the line too. A little bit uh, here and here, and then it's done. So gabarito que filha só para quê, pessoal? You can see how much less cement you have to use also. Só para brotar, né? Vocês veem como é que fica aqui, ó. Olha que frisa bonitinha. Que agora é só terminar de dar um acabamento. E tá perfeito aí o bloco frisado. Look nice. That's how a lady breaks. As you can see it's done. Done deal. So it's going, so going to use the other side. This one is going to use the wood. So let's check the wood. Vamos ver como é que o adiantamento é feito com a paleta. No caso da paleta aqui, pessoal, é o mesmo sistema. Se vocês veem que está puxando demais, vocês não levam até o final não, mas vocês veem que dá para esticar a parede toda. So this is how we do it, but we do it with the I don't know what's called it in English, but they do it like that. I will show you guys a video also. You can buy some car. I don't know what you can do. If the temperature is too hot, you can push it to the end. Look at that. I'm going to push it to the end. I'm going to push it to the end. Pode voltar a massa na cabeça do bloco. Se tiver para dentro, para fora, vocês vão. Se tiver para lá, vocês vão lá para cá. Se vocês não 
não se adaptar naquele jeito que eu mostrei, vocês podem fazer isso aqui, ó. Puxar na cabeça do bloco aqui, ó. Puxar o bloco aqui pra levar lá. So in a sense you can uh, uh, somebody can do it for you and then you can also do it you know you can you can lay this one somebody can prepare it for you and just you just pull it on that one is faster I think I think that is how they do it but he's doing it alone to show us how to do it in Ghana they waste a lot of time with the pulling inside they waste a lot of time but you can see it's done this one is a simple one to do it and it's faster and it's beautiful okay so we're gonna watch this one I'm speeding it up so that you can see it's for Mason he made it himself you can see but this thing you cannot use in abroad okay people so nice you can see the professionals if you go there with this thing they will love you okay don't do it they will really kick you out, just go go away. What are you doing? We pay you a lot of money to lay bricks, not to uh, play here. You see? I've never seen nobody doing this because we're not fly with them. Okay, you can see this one is also better. Okay, you can see that. It's easy. You will lay more bricks <laughs> in uh, two minutes than a Ghanaian would lay because you can see it's nice, nice, really nice, nice, nice. You can see, voila, voila, and then you go on building, building, and before you know it, just eight minutes before you know it, is. Uh, can see going back this guy is working alone you can see because the uh, the cement is soft everything is going in and it's faster 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 you can see that's beautiful 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 this one this guy is going to use the, he has like uh, this from uh, Check this guy also. I don't know. Trick. Do like this. Ah, more bricks. Go like this. It's fast working. Oh, fast working. Making money. But the lady speed is he's speeding up, okay, but still. You can see fast working. Okay. Fast working. Fast working. Voila. So that's also another way to do some bricks. So I'm going to show you guys something. This is how they use it in the West. Everybody is different. This is American style. This is even a competition. So the people that can lay a bricks faster will get a lot of money. I'm gonna show you guys how it goes. Uh, let's start maybe here. Let's start. You can see everybody's working hard making the money. They start from, uh, I think, number one is already done for them. So the only thing they have to do is this one. 
and you can see of a lot of people working you can see everybody's working hard so this is a normal speed there so they are working fast but you, you think that this uh, they are speeding up but it's normal speed and you can see that the thing is also longer This thing is very long, but in the Netherlands, the short, short one. You can see they are very, they are very skilled workers. They make a lot of money, people. Also, I've turned on music because of uh, copyrights. They were playing some music on it, and I don't know if it was a copyright thing or not. Uh, so you can see, people are working hard. Uh, oh yeah, okay. This one is from. Uh, Mason Contractors Association of America. You can see they are working fast. This is like working fast because it's going to get some prizes. You can see fast working. I don't know if ever anybody can join this. I don't know, but you can see it's very. Uh, these people are. Uh, these people are just skills work they go fast and it's like event self you can see event um, and everybody has his own like skills I'm oh, sorry for the internet. I think uh, the internet is going is very slow now. So you can see, they're working fast. And I think they have stopped or something. I don't know. You see, in no time they have. Um, okay, so this guy. You can see that this guy even have like two of them or oh, you can oh this one is even uh, better you can see everything is the same level everything is the same level but these guys have like more they have laid more bricks but maybe it's not good or something i don't know so then they're going to uh, further holes so they have, they have to further holes also you can see they're doing it and like this like that and maybe if it's not clean you also get like punishment so this is how they are filling the holes but everybody has like their own ways of filling the holes okay so let's see this one and yeah and then they finish they're going to get some money for their hard work oh you also have like the small bricks also here you have this also bricks so yeah so that is it Пять миллиметров. Таким же образом я выпиливаю и половинки.
beautiful. So it's from this guy. I don't know what his name is, but oh, brick and brick and stone mason. Nice. Let's look. This is how they make money. A lot of money. So yeah, so I hope that you guys love this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.